coming off the ledge. Nope, that's good enough. Okay. Dude. The Menominee River. Majestic. Beautiful, but deadly. What do you think that water temp is? Probably like 80. It's really warm. <laughs> you serious, Clark? <laughs> Look at that color, man. I say we just fish till they get back. made it 481 miles is what it was on the maps i guess i need to get my rods out of there huh it is it's a boat sorry oh. welcome back to hoosier state fishing we are at the menominee river baby i don't even know this is like oh man came right off this is like probably my 10th fish i can't even i haven't even recorded anything yet really i recorded a little bit when we first got here putting in the water i'm so tired we drove, I don't know, seven something hours, 480 miles to get here from Indiana. We're here, we're fishing. I'll show you what I'm using here in a second. It's Copper Truce Ned Rig, but I've got it rigged completely different. I'm using a Nico hook and it's Texas rigged. And I've got a Nico weight. Here we are, we're on. I've got a Nico weight in the very bottom of it, so the tail's dragging the bottom. Oh yeah, this is great. These fish fight so hard. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice, I think I'm getting sick. I really hope not, because we're gonna be on this river for four days, the next four days. They're all fat. They're all fat and happy. The colors on these fish compared to Indiana just blow me away. Oh, he's peeing all over me. It's so dark, these fish. I really haven't been recording because this is not what we're looking for. <laughs> they sure do fight like they're eight pounders. Got a Jika rig tube on. It's kind of a goby color. That's a fish. That felt like a fish anyway. Oh man, I'm getting tore up right now. That was a fish. I'm messing with little guys right now. There's a fish right there. Man, out of the same little hole, man, they're over here, just stacked up. This is ridiculous, dude. Freaking on fire right now. Just a kind of a goby color, I guess you could call it. But it's a Jika rig, little bitty guy. But you know the Jika rig. Just a, I think this is a two watt wide gap. It's got a split ring tied to the eyelet of the hook and a little one eighth ounce uh, sinker. Let's try another one. Let's, we're looking for bigger quality, man. Bigger fish, bigger fish. There we go, right up in that juice up there. I see a lot of good structure behind me. A bunch of big laid down trees and stuff that I'm gonna go cast to here in a second. I'm gonna go one more cast over here, but up in them trees a little bit. Yeah, right up in there. I'm gonna let the current do the work. There it is right there. Already. Oh, I'm wrapped up. He's got me wrapped up. That's okay. So now that I'm over here trying to get the snag undone, I can definitely see why there's so many fish over here because there's so many brocks. I wonder if this fish is still on. We're gonna find out. Looks like I got, oh, I casted right up into a tree. Oh, he's still on. This fish is still on. No, he's not. He's waiting right next to it though. Let's go ahead and cast over that way. Let's see what we can do. We'll just kind of hang out in this tree for a minute. This seems like a pretty good little choke point. There's a fish right there. Yep, there's one. That's a nicer one, it feels like. There we go. Oh yes, that's a nicer fish. That's a nicer fish right there. That might be measuring board worthy. I can't believe how good they're stacked up in this little pocket here. Yeah, that's a nicer fish. There we go, got him loose. Get this big one on the scale. A little over 15, looks like 15 and three quarter. Now nope, she's right at 16. No, she's not, 15 and three quarter. That'll work. Not bad. Let her go. Peace out. So 
So I forgot to show you what I was using before as far as that uh, the Ned rig. It's not your standard Ned rig. So it's a Ned rig, you know, it's the, it's the small turd, the standard, you know, the little turd by Z-Man. But I've got it rigged on a Nico hook, okay? I've got it Texas rigged. And at the very bottom of it, it's got a little Nico weight. Just a little lead, sharp little needle weight. It's actually way too big for this bait, but it's all they had. But it just drags the bottom, and it stands straight up. Tail down. So, this just happened. I was just mulling around in here, just waiting to get a hook unstuck from, a, from the bottom. Caught my first pike ever. That is freaking awesome, dude. Never, ever caught a pike. Dig. That's awesome, dude. First pike ever. Okay, so I got that little pike off finally. Let him go. I broke off my other little Nico rig that I was using. There's a fish. Oh, that's a bed right there, I think. I have a feeling that's a bed. Ooh, that's a fish. Yep, there he is. Yep, that must be a bed. Must be, get up here. Not a bad fish. Come here, don't you do it, don't do it. A little bitty guy. <laughs> Peace out. Listen, I apologize for the crazy video, okay? I really do. It's been a freaking crazy, it's been a crazy seven, I don't know, even 10 hours, I guess, maybe. It's been absolutely nuts. I think I'm getting sick. I mean, I don't know what's going on with me. I don't feel very good. But uh, I'm just gonna keep going. I'm gonna film as much as I can. I've got two batteries to last me four days, but they're not gonna last very long. It is what it is, man. Just roll with me. We'll catch as many fish as we can. Hopefully we'll get on some big ones. Nailed it. We've got some rapids we're going through. Maya's gonna cliffhanger it on down this bank. Chris is just gonna send it. Loomis is just fishing. <laughs> when you guys go left, just make sure you keep your speed low. Okay? Yep. Don't get going real fast because there's a bunch of, you'll have to be pretty maneuverable when you go through there because there's a bunch of stuff like right in the middle. All right. <laughs> Love you. And this is this, yeah, this could get somebody hurt. Surely. I mean, it really doesn't look that bad once you get up to it, but you don't want to mess around on it either. Nope. There you go. You got it, buddy. Yeah, this, this is pretty tame. <laughs> this is the, the end is the hardest part. You got it! <laughs> uh, yeah, well, well you, got, you might run into Derek, but <laughs> you're gonna hit that rock right there. <laughs> scoot! Scoot it! So here we are, day two, back at it. What is today? Today is Friday? Friday, yeah. Today's Friday. It's a work day. Today's a work day. Yesterday was really rough, man. Is it carb day today? Is it carb day? I think today is. Yesterday was a rough day, either way. I didn't even feel like just, I was, we were all just so tired. I didn't feel like filming. We had to portage these kayaks and the, the float raft for what seemed like miles. Oh, it was miles. It was miles. It was at least a mile and a half. But we got camp going. We got food in our bellies. We got freaking rested up. Today's going to be a good day. Josh is going to brush his blocks, get that sock feeling off his teeth. Loomis is over here stretching out, doing some Pilates. Let's get to it. 